The basketball season came to a close last weekend with two Houston teams playing for state titles. Let's start the show with Booker T. Washington playing in their first ever UIL championship game against heavily favored Faith Family out of the Dallas area. The recap of that 4A state final is our DQ game of the week. Vincent Grayson's bunch took on a Faith Family team they had played and lost to earlier this season. But the Golden Eagles led in that game, so they felt confident going into the final. And they got off to a great start as Andre Walker drained a three-pointer 10 seconds into the contest, prompting an early Faith Family timeout. Chris McDermott would have a tremendous first quarter as he knocked down this turnaround jumper and then would get a follow-up jam. Nine of his team-high 18 points came in the first quarter as Washington went up 20 to 11. In the second quarter, the Golden Eagles would fall behind by four. But when Otis Carter got the steal and layup, they tied the game up at 26 apiece. The second half started off great as Walker makes the nifty pass to McDermott for the monster jam, and Washington was up 32-29. But the Golden Eagles would get hit by a heavy dose of Jaden Toppin and Peyton Gusters. Toppin, the New Mexico commit, would finish with 20 points and help Faith Family to a 50-39 lead after three. And then Gusters would score all 19 of his points in the second half, mostly on dunks as Faith Family pulled away to a 70-56 win to put an end to a magnificent Booker T season. The first ever trip to a UIL state title game for the Golden Eagles, and they had nothing to hang their heads about. Our family just wait, they were waiting for something like this to happen, you know, and it, it's just beautiful seeing them out there like that and supporting us. It's just, it's a good thing. They've been waiting for years. First time going to the UIL tournament, first time going to the Notre championship game. And they just, they just needed something to get to cheer for. I hope, I hope we gave them something to cheer for this year. The Game of the Week is brought to you by Dairy Queen for treats and eats before and after the game.